Hey, what's up? This is Milos and in this video guide I want to show you an easiest way to put custom contents on selected category pages. As you can see, uh, this uh, block is a block with custom contents. By default, it is not possible to define custom contents for selected categories in PrestaShop. But it is possible with my mm, with my HTML box pro module. As you probably know, this module contains feature to create custom hooks and to put these custom hooks to your template. So I created custom hook and I put it here. In this guide I will show you how to create custom hook and how to put it into selected category page. So we have to of course we have to go to my module configuration page and at the bottom you can find add new hook form where you can create new hook so let's name it for example category page hook and we have to click on add hook If you will scroll page down, we will see that our new hook appears here, so I will enable it. And I will create my custom contents for category page number 8, dresses. This is test of my block. It's a name of the mm, block that I will create and I want to display it on selected category page which is equal to 8. And here I will put some code to display for example this is my text. I will customize it a little, for example, I will use header 1, I will add background color and I will change text color to white, for example. And I want to, I want to, I want to center it. So if I will save changes, I will see that module created my new block here. Ok, it's created properly. If I will refresh the page now, this uh, contents will disappear because I added it before and you will see that Mm, it looks like default category page and there is no block that I created. It's because we created custom hook and now we have to add this short code to category.tpl file from your template. So I will open it. It is here as you can see. Oh, it's uh, it, I opened it before. So uh, you have to open category.tpl file and enter and enter this short code to the place where you want to display blocks associated with our new hook. So I will put it into the top of category page. If I will refresh dresses category now, I will see that mm, here is a uh, contents that I created in my new block. Well, if I will now open other category, not mm, define it here in a place where you 
I can define on what mm, category pages my blog will appear. If I reopen other category, as you can see, blog disappeared. If I will now enter ID of the category here, and I will save blog, my new blog will appear also in evening dresses category. In that way, you can create some custom contents that will appear only on selected category pages.